Brox, we're gonna do something different today. This is some big brain stuff. It's not gonna be for a pro, a non-programmer. So if you don't know how to program, how to write scripts, this may not be a video for you. But if you are interested in how it's done, this will be, maybe it will be a learning experience. Maybe it will interest you in the field of programming, right? So we're, what we're gonna build today is these bots. So a lot of people have been wondering, like how did I get all of these prices over here? underscore and how are they updated real time well i want to encourage all the discord community to build their own bots so i want to do this video today to share with you how it's done so you can do it for your own server right let's get started so i actually borrowed the code from this person carlo carlos so he made this code open source and it's really good i really like it and it's built in node.js so if you're in Python, you may be out of luck, but I think the code is easy enough for you to transfer over to any language. So I sort of borrowed it, the index.js, and then I modified it a little bit to suit it to my own need. So currently, it's, this is the code. This is the code I have. I modified it a little bit to make it a bit easier to, to understand and to read. So if you, once you get the script, so this code will be available on my Patreon if you go in there and Donate to my Patreon to help me with support all these videos. You get this full source code. So what's happening is you just need to fill out these three fields, right? Forget about this one, but fill out all these three fields and you'll have your own token display on the right side of your Discord. So let's figure out how we can get all of these values here. So you need four things, coin ID, guild ID, client ID, and bot secret. So to do that, let's first make a bot. So on Discord, you are allowed to create as many bots as you can for your own server and you don't need to pay for it or anything. It's completely free. Uh, the only limitation is your imagination. So you can create a bot to let, ask it to do things for you. And as you can see, I currently have so many bots in my server, uh, one for each price bot. That's what I would like to do over here. So the example we want to do today is a Harmony bot. So I want to do Harmony price bot. Let's just call it one because that's a token name. So you do this, you click on create. So this will create a new bot for you. So you can copy the application ID here, click on copy, and then go to your code. Now the application ID is something for down here. This is commented out, but you'll need this, this link later. So we got that, that's the application ID. Now we need a coin ID. So in order to figure out the coin ID, you need to actually get the name from CoinGecko. And CoinGecko has thousands and thousands of coins on the server. So you need to find the actual ID for it. So we want to find Harmony. There's so many Harmonies out there. So we want to make sure we got the right one. All right, so the ID looks like it's Harmony. Simple is one and name is Harmony. That looks like the one we want. So copy the ID here, paste it in the coin ID. Oops, let me just type it out, Harmony. And that's it, we're done. Now we need a guild ID. What is this? This is your server ID. So um, yeah, I was teaching one of my fellows how to do this. So if you go to your server here and then right click and then click on copy ID, you will get your server ID. Great. And now we need a bot secret. What is that? That is a secret token of your bot. So to do that, you need to click on bot here and then you need to add a bot. Let's make a bot. Done. So click on copy and this will get the bot ID secret ID right here. So that's it, you're done. So now what you have to do is invite the bot to your server. Remember, we got the client ID here, we update it. We just need to go to this link here. And then this will create an invitation to your server. So I'm gonna invite the bot to my server. I'm gonna verify I'm a human. I am a human, right? So click on the new members. This is my channel. It'll tell me that, oh, I just invited one price bot here. Perfect. Now what I do next is I want to give it a role. So the way this is done here, the way all of this is done here is that all of these bots have special role on their price bots admin. So on this score, you can create your custom role and to have it appear on the right sidebar. So you can do this by go to server settings, you can go to roles, and then you can go to the bots. So once you click on this, you can, you can select the property of this bot. Make sure you check this here display role members separately from online members you have to make sure you enable this so all i have to do now is give bots give the bots that permission price bots great now you notice that well how come the price is not appearing 
Well, the final thing you need to do is to run the bots. So you want to make sure this script is currently running. So you can do node node price one dot js. So this will run the bot. You see that? You see just now one appear right here, and that is the price of one right now. And the frequency I have it set is one minute, but you can update that any, to any interval you want. Maybe check it every two minutes, every three minutes. It's up to you. But I'm checking it every minute to make sure I don't hit the um, the threshold for API. But look, there it is, the price of one. Perfect. I hope you guys enjoy this quick video. It's a bit technical, but I think it should be pretty easy to understand. Again, if you, if you guys want the source code of this modified version of the bots, you can support me on Patreon and you'll get the code. But if you don't want to, you can just simply use the code by this person. It's completely free and I'll link in the description below. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoy it. And this is a bit technical, but I hope you guys find it different than my regular content. And I am a software engineer, so ask me any questions if you have in the Discord, and I'll be happy to answer and help you out, all right? See you guys, make sure to like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Have a great day, guys.